Hey, what's good, fam? Today we back in the stool with another banger, and this one we're gonna go over Supreme Week One. Y'all already know when the lookbook drops, Week One drop list comes out too. So that's exactly what we're gonna talk about today. If you do end up enjoying this video, leave a like on it down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new and want to enjoy more of this type of content. And while you're down there, let me know what your favorite item that's gonna be releasing this week is. Obviously, at the end of this video, road to 20k, low key we need like 80 more, 70 more subscribers. So go ahead and join up. We're this close to 20,000. Thank you all for supporting the channel. It means more than y'all would honestly imagine. So we're gonna start from the best items and work our way down to the dookiest pieces at the bottom of the list. I'm not really gonna waste too much time on the pieces that I don't really f with cause I don't really like them. So the first week for Supreme is gonna drop the 25th of August at 11 a.m. Eastern time. If you do live in Pacific or something like that, it does have the different times right up here. Let's get straight into these pieces. All the way at the top of the list, we got the Andre 3000. T. This is one that we've seen for a couple days at this point, and I feel like the more I see it, the more I want to go ahead and buy it. We haven't gotten a solid photo tee in a minute, especially with the wrapper. I feel like the last one was the Nas tee or some shit like that. I don't even remember. I'm not going to lie to y'all. This Andre 3 Stacks tee must cop for me. I want to see what other colors it comes in. If there's a cream, I might have to pick that up. This black does look solid as well. Beanie Baby's going to come out. I feel like this is actually kind of cool. The more I look at it, the more, you feel me, I appreciate it. Am I going to buy it? honestly don't know if it's affordable or like a little add-on item maybe but not too special at least to me looks like some july 4th type beat so we good on that we got the hanes briefs coming out hey hopefully these don't sell out or they stick around for a couple weeks so that i could go ahead and cop because i'm not copping week one i feel like there's way better items to pick up but i do feel like these are gonna linger probably gonna keep restocking them type shit that's how i feel honestly don't know as of yet but that's just an inkling that i have this shoulder bag which a lot of people are fucking with and it's for a reason bro like this shit is beautiful i'm fucking with that olive color i feel like it's not too big it's not too small perfect size for a shoulder bag this is what i remember from when i first started copying supreme the shoulder bags was this shape not no fucking messenger bag not no weird shit with some stripper net on it this is clean and honestly i might have to pick this up in that olive color i don't have any olive shoulder bags if i'm not mistaken so i might have to get this one right here box logo t-shirt skate deck is gonna be dropping this week honestly the skate decks this season are looking beautiful i feel like this one is actually solid simply because it's not just a simple box logo on it they actually threw the t on there little twist and we haven't gotten like an all white supreme skate deck with a box logo in years bro so this is beautiful i want to see if items like this are going to have resale or if supreme is just dead at this point we got the supreme toyo steel toolbox this one's actually clean bro the more i look at it the more i want to cop it i just want to see what retail is going to be on an item like this if it's anything near 100 i think i'm straight but if it's somewhere like 70 60 dollars i might consider picking the toolbox up let me know if this is an item that y'all messing with honestly the top of this list so far is looking pretty solid this catwoman tee is a must cop bro this is probably my favorite shirt that's going to be dropping i'm a sucker for graffiti and bubble letters at the same time so this is right up my alley it almost gives me like comic book title vibes if that makes sense i'm fucking with this i don't feel like we've ever gotten a cat woman piece from supreme so this is clean let me know if this is an item that y'all gonna be going for honestly i need it in this cream color nothing else bro if i do get it probably gonna be in this or a black because i feel like it would just translate better we got the nebo slim 1200 pocket light hey you feel me if the light goes out you got a little pocket light i wonder if this is solar powered or you need batteries in this bitch at the end of the day if you need a little flashlight not bad we got the tenugui tenugui towel set so there's two of these towels that are gonna come together i wonder if these are smaller it says 13 by 35 so these are kind of small to be honest but it's still not that bad you feel me if you need a little face towel or some shit like that for the bathroom this isn't bad we got some olive oil dropping bro if you're some ogs and you know the olive oil joke let me know in the comments but yeah there's olive oil coming out bro shit's crazy that they're even doing this i wonder if the olive oil is good bro like it has to be why would supreme be dropping some olive oil it has to be some italiano type shit the hand tagless tees same shit as the briefs on a t low-key i'm good on the tees not gonna lie to y'all but the briefs is where it's at for me there's the s logo hooded sweatshirt this one comes in six colors honestly that brown one is looking beautiful i'm still not off 
the horns that they put on it it's just so unnecessary bro like without that shit this would have been a banger in my opinion i don't really feel like it needed that and it just looks unnecessary so we good on that shit we got the slap shot t which is like that lakers font kind of giving me like a motion vibe to it i'm fucking with this one but i don't know if it's a piece that i would actually buy type shit like i was saying earlier the skate decks are actually fire this season and this trash skate deck is looking beautiful if y'all know me you know i was born in new york so this is right up my alley i don't know how i feel about all the trash right there but the statue of liberty with the clouds behind it does look really nice i wish it would have had something different besides literally trash but you got to take the good with the bad bro <laughs> i still think this might be a cop i just got to see where my pocket's looking like this week but we got this small banana waist bag right here it has like a long ass Thin. I don't know what the fuck is going on. Like this just looks a little too weird. Like I don't know how I feel about the dimensions of this waist bag. So it's kind of ass to me, bro. S logo with the little horns on the S. Like come on, son. Just remove that. And this shit would have been a must cop for me. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I love my fitteds. I love the S logo. Why put some horns on the S? Like I just I don't know, bro. This Mary rhinestone short sleeve is Virgin Mary on a short sleeve top with some rhinestones on it. But remember, this is top price. So this is probably gonna be like 80 90 dollars i don't see it going for anything below 70 bro something i'm gonna pass on bro because i could buy the andre 3k and the catwoman tee for the price of this mary unless you really love this shit i just would stick away from it duffel bag is one that i have to click on bro the duffel bags this season are beautiful i love the way that it has the double strap on the top the cargo pockets on the front beautiful piece bro honestly for traveling purposes i feel like this is a must cop in that black color i have a duffel bag bro and i've beat my shit i've used that shit hella times time and time again i've actually used that duffy let me know how y'all feeling about the bags this season i feel like they actually didn't drop the ball on them this milano half zip pullover if you in italy or that type of vibe if it gets cold on the soccer field this is what you're wearing right here the little supreme milano joint with the little italy flag on the sleeve i think it's not bad but it's just too preppy for me like it's not something that i would go out and buy type shit especially from supreme like i would buy some shit like this for a single hand occasion not for some shit that i would wear every day or too often to be honest we got the trash tea which the more i look at it the more i'm trying to debate if i should buy it bro there's a lump of trash and then you got the statue of liberty i just wish it was a little more better bro i'm not gonna lie backpack is gonna be coming out too this one comes in the same four colors on this one it's a little bit tricky though i don't know how i feel about this because it has that supreme going all the way down then it has like a fucking handle on the book bag like who is gonna carry their book bag from a handle not even on the top like on the front type shit like like, nah good on that shit we do got the camp cap which i'm kind of fucking with that zebra one bro i don't normally well i'm literally lying bro i got a fucking loud ass hat on right now but that zebra one ain't looking too bad maybe it's calling my attention because it's dead in the center it's not bad i also am fucking with that brown color i feel like we don't normally see a brown camp cap and if we do it probably has like some velour or some bullshit on it we got this large tote bag which i low-key need this shit for when i go to bj's bro like let me put my little downy and shit in here and bring it upstairs without a hassle i think this might be a must cop it all depends on what retail is gonna be if they taxing on that shit they could keep it to themselves bro like we're not even doing all that we got the small box logo crew neck this one comes in like seven different colors i don't think it's one of the pieces that you go out of your way for on week one there's so much other shit releasing bro like you could do better i feel that you could do better i'm not gonna lie. yo we got the fucking homeless jacket dropping this week i really fuck with this jacket but i'm not gonna lie it's literally falling apart like it's last thread is about to be loose bro like if you put this shit in the wash it's over for you you cannot wash this shit this is like a single use one time for the one time ass jacket shit is falling apart bro falling apart and the worst part is i'm fucking with it but i actually like the damn jacket i feel like retail is gonna be at least like 500 dollars for this shit simply because it probably took them a while to make it look like it's almost gonna fall apart we got the s logo sweatpants with the y'all already know how i feel about the design you got the organizer pouches coming out do come in a set of three so hey if you in it to get a bang for your buck this is what you're looking for right here i don't know what you're gonna use these for maybe some toiletries some school utensils whatever you need to put in here you could probably put in one of these sizes for me not a must cop i'm low-key leaning towards the shoulder bag we got this warning tee which i've been trying to decipher what the fuck this means ever since last night it basically has supreme with a little hand and a little cancel thing 
then on the back it says pass it on others warn other people no chip inside is this like a sign or some shit like i'm trying to understand bro but i just can't like it's not coming to my head right now you got some wheels coming out shit's ass the small box tee that woodland camo one ain't bad the brown ain't bad but besides that we solid on that elephant tee i'm fucking with dude mans with the tims on bro you cannot sleep on elephant bro elephant is coming too hard this season like dead ass this is the homie bro it's love at first sight with this i might have to pick this up simply because that's my mood right now but i'm not gonna lie the no love short sleeve top i think this one's actually not bad it's simple has a little heart the little cancel on it no love i feel it sometimes not all the time so i don't know if i'm fucking with that t right there we're gonna get past that shit we got the stone wash slim denim they said slim they're dropping some slim denim bro they're not baggy that's fire i'm not gonna lie just the fact that they added slim to it is fire we got the elephant skateboard this one is probably my favorite skate deck that they're dropping this season i don't know why it's so low i told y'all before elephant is the bro bro so i gotta support the bro and this one has supreme going down the side in different colors almost looks playful like those little kid block letters from when we were younger that's what that's giving off to me we got the heavenly silk there's a little angel holding a supreme flag i don't know if there's nothing too crazy going on right here but this isn't one of the pieces that i would even care for on a week one or even week seven we get on a griffin zip up hooded sweatshirt this is the same homeless jacket but converted into a sweater bro this shit should be half off off rip like it literally half of the material is falling off but it's fire like the cream and the black fire i love the color choices i don't know about that yellow but the other two looking pretty clean classic team five panels like a snapback comes in hella colors honestly the brown and the black are my favorite the trucks i don't really care about that small box logo sweat shorts literally has a logo this small on that bitch brush cordura small six panel this is actually a clean little hat and that olive or the cream kind of fucking with it braces tee they could hold that shit bro like they could definitely keep that shit in the fabric bro yeah nah keep that shit in the flesh bro we good we got the five pocket homeless pants same concept on some pants low key we got some regular jeans we good on the regular jeans this shirt is ass these jeans look like you dead ass about to wear some beef and brock timberlands and sell fucking comedy tickets in times square type shit the lion's den short sleeve this one's actually kind of clean bro it's giving me a nice vibe well not nice because they're deadly it's giving me like a different type of vibe that we don't normally get from supreme the lions are literally chilling while i buy it never in my life we got the state hooded sweatshirt ass this over dyed patch beanie is actually not that bad bro it's giving me the bad dude from four brothers before he got dropped inside the ice vibes i don't know why but if y'all find that clip his beanie is as ribbed as this beanie right here i'm not gonna lie elephant hooded sweatshirt elephant and his homies are taking over bro i don't know why they're dropping all the elephant shit week one but elephant deserves some respect on his name bro studded quilted leather jacket hey yo this is the pele pele remixed right there the two-tone panel jeans son tell me you're not gonna wear these jeans and the cream with the olive and the thames i was talking about earlier bro look at this it's the fit right here bro the two-tone panel with the plaid shirt both as ass as it can be we got the joy de vivre tea this one basically has a couple sayings on it with some dude holding some money ass the lorex short sleeve i don't even remember seeing this shit yesterday bro so ass we got the slim jeans the mock neck is actually kind of fire bro it's like one of those simplistic essentials vibes and i'm fucking with it that tan color is beautiful the one in the back it has the little supreme classic logo this is actually a clean piece bro the rainbow speckle beanie shit is trash transport mesh cap ass gone with the fucking they're literally mocking jesus like this is crazy to me i never used to see it before but i see it now but i don't understand why but just why like i'm good on that shit the two-tone panel denim jacket the jacket is not that bad bro and that cream with the olive is actually looking kind of clean bro i probably would never spend my money on it but it's still looking clean the abstract stripe shit is ass for the siento those are like some wrestler pants we got the wombat tee which is cheeks the decals moto ass bro a lot of shit at the bottom of the list y'all know how this goes should be trash panel track pants in the black aren't too bad the porciento soccer jersey so it's soccer bro i thought it was wrestling let me know in the comments if this is your top one pick like don't even lie bro you know you about to buy that shit the elephant sweatpants bro homie is unstoppable bro he is unstoppable like look at dude bro he's pulling up to the scene that ass jackward panel track jacket nope the webbing camp cap shit is ass the crushers mm. it almost gives me like vintage levi slash old navy like i don't know what is 
is giving off right now, bro. Two-tone rib zipper. Okay, okay. Oh, that was the last piece, low key, bro. All right, so for me, I'm not gonna lie to y'all, the best pieces are the Andre 3 stacks, the little beanie baby, you feel me? If you want a little Supreme plushie in your collection. Shoulder bag is actually sick. I feel like it's a must cop for me this week and not olive color, silver one. It looks like the inside of a lunchbox. This pocket light, you feel me? If the lights go out, you got some light in your pocket. Catwoman T, gorgeous, bro. Must cop for me. This is probably my favorite after the Andre 3 stacks. Toolbox, if it's anything over $80, they could hold this shit and sit down on it, bro. Like, we good on that. We got the box logo t-shirt skate deck. I think it's a cop. Not better than the elephant one. There's some more sprinkle sprinkles going down this list, but everything is hit or miss, bro. It's either you like it or you don't. And that's just the way that shit goes. Let me know what your top three picks for this week are. Are you even gonna decide to go for anything this Thursday? Remember, 11 a.m. Eastern time. Let me know in the comments what you're gonna be going for. But yeah, man, I'm excited. I hope that this season has some solid collabs. I feel like we got some more heat coming down the line. So make sure you subscribe. We're literally like 70 away from 20,000. Thank y'all, bro. For real, I cannot thank you enough. This shit takes a toll sometimes, bro. I skip out on going out sometimes. I sit down here after work, working again sometimes. And a lot of people don't even notice the work that goes on when you have to do this or when you feel like you have to do this because you have an obligation. But yeah, man, thank y'all so much. Like, I can't even say it enough. Leave a like on this video if you enjoyed. Let me know in the comments if you're going to be going for anything. Best of luck this week to all of you guys. And with all that being said, I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. Peace, stay up, and I'm out.